Hi guys. So um, each week, I my goal this year is to take two of my to be read books and move them from my to be read to to I love books. And I read Rebecca Shea um, a while back, and I really fell in love with her writing style with her Bound of Lies series and. It's just the way she writes suspense and love, it just, it captured me. And so I downloaded her Unbreakable and I couldn't put it down. Yes, it's kind of a young of age. You know, these the, these characters are um, just right out of high school and going into college and just kind of finding their life. But there's so much meaning in this book. Jessica is, at the time, she's 18 and she just... She has her life set out and she knows what she's going to do and she knows how she's going to navigate her life. She's always had these feelings for Gabe. Gabe is, um, in essence, the guy next door, but he's the guy next door that has had her heart from the moment she's seen him, like the butterflies, the, the whole Twitter patient that she has, if that's a word. Um, that's kind of how Jess feels about Gabe. And Gabe is the athlete. He's, you know, goes to Arizona, um, which, yay, that's where I, um, yay U of A. So um, it's it's pretty amazing how he knows what he wants at his age. He doesn't really know if he wants to stay being the jock and the athlete. He wants to go get the job that he that he's really interested in and go start living his life. And it just happens that Jessica is part of that. And these two end up forging their relationship and find out there's there's so much connection and bond that they're this they're, they're cemented that's deep rooted with their relationship. But tragedy happens, and this is where I was the ugly crying like holy crap, what am I reading? Threw me this threw me because I didn't know what I was really gonna read. I just thought this was gonna be love love in young romance, you know, that kind of whole thing. I just wasn't expecting this suspense in this. And when this happened, it threw me and it was emotional and it was beautiful. And she, Rebecca wrote it just, it, it was extremely suspenseful for me because how she wrote it and how Jess dealt with it was even better. So she leaves to kind of get herself back together. Gabe tried to fix her and tried to help her, but he didn't know how to do it the right way. And Jess was heartbroken. And for her, it was leaving. And he said, Gabe said some things that, you know, our bond is unbreakable. And it's true. They're, they had a bond that was unbreakable, but they had to they had to find what was their breaking point to heal themselves. And this book is um, extremely cathartic. It's extremely powerful. And the scars that, um, these, that Gabe and Jess have, they're healing. And there's some other people in this story that really are her healing factor. And I recommend this book. Um, it's a roller coaster of suspense love, angst, and there's just, it's a beautiful ending and recommend it. And now I'm going to go read um, Unforgiven and Undone because I liked it so much I want to go read the next three in this series. So recommend it. Rebecca Shea, you're, you're, you're one of my favorites now. So hope you guys have a great day and follow along. Talk to you later. Bye.